All right, welcome back everybody to the channel. I am Old Guy Jammin. We are going to check out Jorn Land's performance on Eurovision, which is pretty darn cool. It's like America's Got Talent, but it's over in Europe, and it's probably so much better. It showcases live bands and art, which is really cool. Our own AGT here has gotten so sappy, I can hardly even watch it anymore. In fact, I'm probably going to let it go because uh, it's, the talent has gone way down and it just seems anymore the only thing you need to do to get on the show is have been bullied at school at some point. You tell your bullying, I've been bullied story, which is bad, I get it, but the talent has come down and anybody with the I've been bullied story gets on and advances. And I think a lot of really talented people are losing interest in the show because it's going that route, where it used to be kind of cut and dry. Hey, your performance sucks. You're not good enough for this show. So the level of talent was higher. Anyway, Eurovision, we're gonna check that out. Here's my own collection of some Yorn-related CDs. If you're just getting your feet wet with this, try to get Ark Burn the Sun. Hard to find, I'm sure, but some of the best Yorn, early Yorn, before he was Yorn. Ma Otsby played guitar on that, but gosh, World Changer is great. The Duke, it's all really, really good. The two albums, did he do three with Master Plan or two? Um, I know at least he did two albums with Master Plan. Those are must haves. You've got to have that. And one I don't even have in my stack here, also that's super killer, is Spirit Black. One of the best albums ever by Jorn. So if you are not familiar with him, get familiar with him and get over to this channel and sub up. Now, if you're new to my channel, stick around and maybe even consider subbing. We do a lot of cool stuff here. We make stuff like this... Uh, guitar stand out of recycled cardboard we made just recently a four button pv foot switch for the invective amp uh, all homemade thrift store stuff or you know for the switches and wire we went to amazon but this stainless piece was modded from a thrift store buy and this works great for the invective so super cool there but we do some fun things, some mods, some speaker replacements, other things, and we even play guitar once in a while. So, think about that. I'm out of focus. Why am I out of focus? There we go. All right, you ready to check out Yorn? Oh my goodness. And this was just a uh, couple weeks ago. Fate, bloody fate. Fate, bloody fate. He did just release a box set called 50, a collection of all his work. I have it, so I don't need it. Wow, big show. A lot of pyrotechnics. A lot of lasers. Hey, he looks good. He just lost some weight, looks thin. Looks like he's got some new bandmates to supporting crew. Oh! Oh, there it is. Woo. Goosebumps from head to toe. He's got such great hooks, and he seems about hope. All backed up for really great hard rock, banger rock. He never has to yell or scream, he just sings. He's got great range. Kind of a Celtic feel, which is typical for a yarn. Wow. Little My Wrath. Are we out in the sand? Cool lady drummers. Hey, there's fire everywhere. Fire and lights. Great stage. Huge stage. Great performance. Why can't we do this here in America? God 
God versus God versus man versus life. Right. I hope he's, uh, I hope this is a preempt to, uh, a new album of these. <laughs> the guitarist is wearing, uh, what looks like a bunch of mink or a wolf or something. Uh, I'm sure it's just part of the costuming, part of the Celtic costuming. He's got a man bun, a big fur hanging on him. Nice. That's just amazing. I hope those people realize what a treat they just had. Uh, getting to see Yorn perform for them. That's great. Okay, uh, so purpose of this today was to try to get as many people as we can over to the Yorn channel. I'll put a link in the description and get over there if you could hit that subscribe button because we want this to grow. We want him to be successful at this. I heard um, a viewer wrote in and said that he and Frontier the label have split up and so I think he's probably dipping his toe into uh, YouTube and internet releases like Gus G has been doing a lot of that there's a lot of bands that are label less these days and they're putting things out through the internet and being really successful but we would like him to feel really successful and feel supported Mr. Yorn Land so He's only got 5,000 subscribers right now. So please, get on over there. I'll put the link in here and do your best to get over there and subscribe. Share it your, yourself. Put it on your social media. Let's see if we can't get this thing blown up so that we have a lot more of Yorn Rock. You with me? All right, let's do it. Okay, so... Uh, we will. Old, old Guy Jammin' is out. We'll see you all on the rebound at a later date. Got some stuff coming up, so stay tuned for that. We've got a uh, D, uh, DSL-5 versus the DSL-20 coming up next. Which one is right for you? All right, you guys all take care. Get over there and subscribe.